How's it going gamers? Today I'm going to be trying to help you guys come up with a better lighting setup for your gaming setup. Most of you guys are trying to achieve something like this. I know it's not perfect, but it's pretty nice looking and for something that cost me less than $50, I think it's a pretty sweet deal. If you guys are starting with something that looks like this, then this is a video for you because I'm going to teach you exactly what you guys need to get and how you need to set it up to get something that looks a little bit more something like this. So let's rewind a little and start with where you're probably at. The very first thing that you guys are gonna need is a directional light for your face. So you guys can have a dark background, but still have light on your face so that you're visible. Just a reminder, this is what it looks like without my ring light. Ring lights are really cheap and you guys could actually get these at places like Five and Below and Walmart. But if you guys wanna get a little nicer one on Amazon, there's a link to one down below. These things are really nice because they give you good lighting on your face. It's not perfect, but hey, for $50, this lighting setup is pretty sweet. Most of these things come with like a little tripod, but you guys might want to get a mount for it like I have. It just makes things a little bit easier and it looks a little bit nicer. You have less stuff on your desk and all that jazz. So now that we've talked about the ring light, let's go to the next step. So if you guys want your lighting setup to look something like mine normally does, you guys are going to want to turn off your main light. All right, so now the focus is on my face. You guys aren't really paying attention to the stuff in the background as much, and I think I stand out a lot more. I think it looks pretty professional as well. It's not perfect, like I said, but it's not bad. So the next step, you guys are gonna want some lighting. So personally, I have another setup in this room, and it makes us a pretty cool backdrop. You're able to see the RGB on my keyboard and my PC back there, and occasionally I have my little dinosaur set up there that looks kind of cool. But really the only other thing you need in order to achieve the lighting that I have is some RGBs. So let's take a look real fast. All right, so now this is basically my full setup. All I did was I put RGBs around the entire ceiling in here and it gives a nice glow to the room. So instead of the background just being dark, now it has a little bit of a glow and some mood lighting. I will have a link to some RGB strips down below that I recommend and I think you guys will be pretty happy with these results. For under $50, you guys could get something that looks something like this. And if you're skeptical, this is what it looks like on just an iPhone camera. So that is all you guys need to have a half decent camera setup. There's no excuses. Some RGB and a ring light and I think you're A-OK. -okay. Make sure you guys check out those affiliate links down below if you guys want to get those products. It helps my channel out a ton and doesn't cost you a cent less. I'll see you guys on the next video. Have a good one.